guys welcome one more day today we're going to see the power of the zip night today we're going to work on this one is the 2015 2019 2015 okay it's the two pilots and a crv we land the part through both and one is just regular so we're going to use the zip knife i'm going to go fast it's a lot of work so i'm going to do these three jobs in one time what i'm saying is pull it out faster i got the stripped parts and this is we call it the serious job you working in series like one two three one two three you strip three times strip all the parts second one could cut them off three clean it off three and start installing the glass i got my glasses ready primer and everything so i'm gonna go one by one install it and we finish okay so i'm gonna go first remember three quarters one inch one and a half just to go faster all right so let's start and i got a one anchor inside with my T handle, I right, remember inside and make the first cut. Your hand protecting the pain, don't make any scratch. Now make the turn between the molding. And if you've made it on the first cut, you're good. If not, second one is one inch. Protecting the paint with your glove. Make sure it's cut already. We're gonna use one and a half on the bottom. Change a little bit the angle. Just on this part. Now here, you continue and you can make a scratch. The only you have to do is turn, and the blade will be making the cut. Alright, but I, I went a little far over here and that's all. Now I put the anchor if in case it's not enough for the double glue, but I think we'll be fine. So let's check it out here. Alright. Make the turn all the way here. Watch out for the pain. Okay. And the last part. Go a little more higher to avoid the pain. Out. All the way out. And cut it. You got the same, you know, the second part of the glue. You're gonna do just with the T. Let me take these guys out. Let's go for the next one. <clears throat> now we're gonna use the T handle. Don't tear the core. Easy, easy. We're too close to the edge of the glass. We're gonna open this guy a little bit and just finish the cut. All right. Just a little piece right here, okay? One is ready. Let's go for the other ones. I'm gonna use the quick sets here, so for the off both three. I mean for the three of them. I don't want to take it just to know where will be the spot. I got a couple of suction cups today. That's another big deal. Remember this bend has to go up go up because many glassmans they are sitting like this. That's not right, it has to be I can set here, here, but I'm gonna do it probably, let's see, right here. Okay. 
or I can sit right here, driver or passenger, okay? So not a big deal, okay? Let's go out. <clears throat> There you go. So let's go. The second one, okay? We're gonna do the same thing. This one has been replaced, got a lot of glue. They re-glue the moldings, you know. The same thing every time you saw in cars. Alright, so we're ready there. Now we're going to do the same thing. We're going to go half. It's going to hurt today. All right. Control the blade. All the way down. I'm protecting my finger to without scratch. The noise you hear is the glass. Let's go with half. I mean, one inch. That noise is the as the glass, okay? Now the paint. Okay, let's see what we're here. We're ready. Now, here. I'm gonna ruin the blade. As soon as I get it, on this side, I'm gonna ruin the blade between the molding. And, yeah, remember the, the blade from Ecolizer, like this one they call the C-blade? That's for those kind of moldings, but I don't have it. That's the old school blade. For, it's for more than interiors, quarter glass. Now here, what I'm doing is use this guy to make the turn and cut between the glue and the molding, okay? Go all the way up. Careful with, don't scratch anything. And just run the blade. So you can take this one out now and it will be more easy to run the blade one and a half. Okay. Now we can take this molding out. Throw away. Now we're gonna use the one and a half. Careful, don't hurt yourself with those blades. Okay, I'm finished the cut. With your tea. That one will be more harder. It's a lot of glue. The molding, they stuck the molding. Everything has a lot of glue. Right, let's see what we can do. Alright. Now let's go down here. Okay. guys one more no I need my set for the big set 
<sighs> We're gonna use another suction cap. Remember, the bend has to go up, not down. Okay, people sitting like this, I repeat. This is not right. You touch the hood like that. This one is the right one. You see, always the same fair first will be the same one. Over here. <coughs> that one, remember, is lie a little bit because remember, we took the molding on the bottom. So, this one will need this spot because the molding will pull it out. Okay, that's the room you need for the molding. Okay, don't forget it. Second one. This is not much glue attached, but let's see. One more cat. They put a lot. One and a half. Always one and a half check your interior, okay? Don't stick the blade in the interior or scratch it or cut it. I have to do a lot. Guys. Now the bottom, because they put a lot of glue here. Let's see, I'm not gonna run three quarters of one inch because um, the glue is really deep. So I'm just gonna run the one and a half. You can run with the tractor, but remember I cannot use a tractor anymore. That's because I didn't protect my hands when I was young and I cannot use anymore. I'm not talking about the vibration, anti-vibration gloves, okay? You guys love tractor, better you use those guys or you're gonna have problems later. I know because I got those problems. Every night you don't know how painful is that problem. That's why you don't sew me working with Tractors anymore. It's a lot of glue here. Okay, let's go work with the core. All right. A long blades. I don't like this one. They're really deep. Remember, today is old school. By right now, it's cool. We gotta handle those cores. Now here you gotta go down or you're gonna snap the line, okay? Because I'm touching the glass. Like this. Uh. There you go. Just careful. There's a lot of glue in that corner. Just make sure you are on top. Shine. Now here, I have to go this way, okay? I know with this tractor will be easy, but I cannot use it. Medical problems. I know. I go all the way there. If 
if I make a double loop it's easy so you make a double loop and just pull it it's no stress okay but I'm not using that so I'm I'm just uh, making a one Actually, when you make double loop they never broke except if you touch the edge of the glass all right and the last one or you have a wire you can do with wire that one will get like a bump really easy but I want one piece I don't want to get another one just like that I like hard work there you go come on and the last cut I didn't put this guy right. Okay. There you go, guys. That's all. Alright. And I still got a little piece of glue there. I told you. This guy's got a lot. We are classmates, right? And the last kit. There you go. That's all, guys. Okay. Now the third one with the quick set. And we're done. So I'll see you in the next shot just to put the windshields on. And we finish. Remember to bend up. This guy will be using the last wheel on the bottom and the second attachment. Like this. This guy will be one right here. Okay guys, and that's the third one. Whew. You see I gotta clean all that glue. And let me guys put a lot there and that's all all right that's the turn one okay guys so so we finish thank you so much for watching see you in the next shot we're gonna just clean it up put primers clean it up and finish okay thank you so much you see this one was a lot of glue you see the top a lot the bottom you see really thick almost like an inch more than an inch in this area that's why I have more problems on the corners but no big deal this one I have to put new clips and all that stuff okay guys thank you so much for watching so see you next shot because we got a more job to do thank you so we're just gonna set the first one Remember, we're gonna find just the H right there. The bin number is right here. So, there you go. And remember, a little bit like a quarter right here on the clip. down the quarter quarter the same the other side and that's it okay guys so see you next shot he's got another one two more right there all right see you hey next shot now we're gonna do the Honda Pilot the second one this be ready remember we have a little more higher that's it. So got a quarter for each clip. Everybody's living in this place. <clears throat> I'm 
not use I'm not using tape because it's the X30 so high density so no problem okay guys so I'm gonna just put it down and see you in the last one and we're finished okay we do the see last one okay oh, it's kind of windy today let me see if I can get avoid this guy all right so have to do remember to set it up right there go ahead and I gotta put the new clips, okay? It's got a new clips, but I clean it up first and after that I'm gonna put the little 315 for Sika and that's all finished okay guys so thank you so much that's all for me we got the same position we're gonna put the clips on and we don't the only we use is universal molding at the top because they don't want to pay for a new one but the clips they pay so I'm gonna use the 315 Sika for those clips but the SD card is enough for them for that uh, for that car so I'm gonna put the video later for the using the 315 for Sika okay guys thank you so much it's too hot today guys so see you next shot bye bye